who I love, who's a great mate of mine. So I watched the pilot and just loved it. And that, I was hooked then, you know, I really, and then watched the second season. I was in the process of watching the second season when I was in LA. And they asked me if I would go and see the cast and directors, and I was like, sure. And at that time, I, don't, I didn't know the comic books. At that time, it was like a substantial character. That's all they kept saying. And then I met Glenn Mazzara, who's our showrunner, a uh, brilliant showrunner, and I uh, met him. And then by the end of that week, they were asking me if I was interested in this role, and they filled it out a bit more. And I just said, yeah, definitely. And then it got announced, and then I, 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 it all started kicking off then about what the character was, and who he was, and I started to really and it's been fantastic ever since. It's been really great to be on. It's a wonderful show to join. And really, we're, we're all having such a great time. Uh, yeah, it was really just like a you know traditional auditioning process. Was, uh, the, the auditioner, or the, rather the casting director, she's known me for several years. She just had me as one of the many that she thought would be a great fit. And had, I came in for the initial audition, and that's when I actually watched uh, the shows when I got the original audition. Before I was looking for it, I watched all the shows and we said, who's this character? What about Judy? This one, that. Uh, and then I, you know, caught up and I got, I'm a scary cat. I never watched the show before. I knew it was acclaimed. I knew it was far more than a zombie show, but to me, it was one of those shows I avoid because I don't like. I don't like to not sleep at night. You know, I mean, my own racing thoughts are bugging enough. I don't need to then start thinking about what, what was that noise and what's that shadow. So, like, you know, I've been a scared cat my whole life, which is what it is. So I, I was gonna avoid it, but I had to watch it now. So, um, you know, and then I got sucked in after the pilot. I watched the pilot, and then, yeah, it was scary as heck, but it was so compelling, and great television, beautiful storytelling. And it was about, like, what, who would you become, you know, once this, what, if this happened? You know, so, it was like the Lord of the Flies. It wasn't about, you know, oh, you know, zombies, 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 zombies. It was something so much more, it's much richer. So then I got really compelled and really desirous to be a part of it. And then, you know, I did the first thing, and she said, okay, you're one of the many people I'm putting on tape. And, you know, you know, you just think you'd be great for it. You're just you're so strong. You're so this, but you know, you know. And I'm thinking, oh God, get it. I'm like one of the many she's putting on tape. <laughs> Peace out. So, you know, I was then like, you know, I had to go do something else, and um, I was out of town, and, and you know, but now I was sucked into the show. I was trying to watch, but I it was like, this, you can't tell anyone. You've got audition from shown. Can't tell anybody. It was a different name on the audition side and everything. And so. Um, you know, after a couple of weeks, they're like, they want to know your height. I'm like, okay. <laughs> uh, what height works for them? <laughs> um, <laughs> what height would you like me to be? <laughs> exactly. I could be 5'4, I could be 5'7. Um, and then it was, you know, a little bit more, a little bit more. And then it was a test, and then it was two sessions with the producers, and it was, you know, finally I got the part. And after all that, you know, I got the part, and it was, it was great. It was, it was the, the way it, it, can, it should be, you know, right? You're like the rite of passage to getting a role. So I, I, um, I went in, I got in that way, and then, yeah, it did feel different once that was, that announcement was made, you know, and they're like, you'll never read the internet again, <laughs> I was told, and, um, you know, warn your family, things were about to change. Such a huge character. It was Friday, and then they announced, they announced it on, when the finale aired on Sunday, so I had two days I couldn't tell anybody. And then, texting me like, is that you, Danai Guerrero, that didn't announce? Because you never told me <laughs> that this was happening, including my own family. But um, yeah, so it was that, that was the process. 